What is up guys, Rick Hack is here going over the Her Courtesy, the Queen's Shotgun unlocked from opening the large chest at the end of a Prison of Elders run with a treasure key. Now let's get started with the review. Alright, let's start off with the stats. Now the stats of the Herd Curse, you can see the main stat here is impact. That is quite a high impact even for a shotgun. Range isn't a slouch, but everything else is pretty subpar, and the magazine size of 5 is fairly average. You can see where I can compare it to a very common gun, the Found Verdict. The Found Verdict just wins. In every single category, it either matches the Herd Curse or straight out beats it, and that's definitely a downside of the Herd Courtesy. Now let's go over the perks of the Herc Cursey. Well, first off, it should be mentioned that this gun is able to be reforged. So you just head over right here to the gunsmith and you can see that you can reforge this weapon and completely change its perks for a mode of light, some weapon parts, and some glimmer. Now, since the one statistic that was very high was impact, I wanted to do as much as I could to increase the range in order to increase the one-shot potential of the Herc Courtesy in the Crucible. Now, to do that, you can see that you know the first choice of three have some different ballistics and I went with the field choke as you can see if I have my starting uh, ballistic on field choke does greatly increase the range at the expense at the great expense of some stability now rangefinder is also very good and you do have the advantage of over the found verdict like I just said the found verdict beats this gun in every single aspect in terms of stats but rangefinder is arguably a more useful perk especially on the crucible for a shotgun which the found verdict can never spawn with. Now going down I also have rifled barrel that increases I'm going to put flared marigold on so you can see rifled barrel increases the range as well again at great expense to the reload but I really did want to go all out with that range. Now, Snapshot's decently useful, and so is Flared Magwell, but Army of One, I mean, I would have preferred something to increase the range, but after spending so many modes of light, I decided that this was a pretty good roll, and Army of One is not useless. Unassisted kills, which are going to be a lot of your kills because you are capable of a one-shot kill, reduce your grenade and melee cooldown. That is pretty useful. Now, how does the Her Courtesy perform in PvP? Well, I certainly did enjoy my time with the Her Courtesy. It definitely is a very powerful and useful shotgun in the Crucible. It kind of did feel like Fell Winter Jr. I mean, in terms of the impact, you definitely have a lot of one-hit kills coming your way. And range, I mean, since I dedicated my entire build of this gun and all of my perks to range, I found the range really wasn't that bad, especially when I did zoom down sights in order to take charge of that range finder perk I was getting some of the kills where I was kind of like oh you know that was a one shot awesome that was a great feeling and I mean again I didn't hate this gun I did actually enjoy this gun the problem with PvP lies not with this gun but with another gun the Matador 64 now speak of the devil the person I was playing with my teammate actually got the Matador 64 while I was testing the her courtesy and you can see when I compare guns that the Matador 64 completely unupgraded again my teammate just got this gun the range is so much better than the her courtesy and the her courtesy that I have Again, has everything is dedicated to just increasing the range. So the Matador 64 really is Fellwinter light. It might actually compete with Fellwinter. Trying to change your her courtesy into a Fellwinter wannabe might not be a great idea because there is just an unbelievably superior option lying within the Matador 64. And I can't even imagine that gun with the perfectly reforged perks in order to increase the range to max with that. Alright, so let's go into PvE and how the Her Courtesy performs there. Well, in PvE, again, you have a very, very powerful gun. This gun's damage does match the found verdict, so it's capable of quite a bit of one-hit kills. I was actually whipping out the Her Courtesy because mine was void. I was taking it out in the level 34 Prison of Elders against the Vex. Because of the Minotaurs, it was pretty good against them. Now, that was until I was streaming at the time, and I was begged by the people that are watching the stream to upgrade the found verdict with an etheric light to 365. 
after that, <laughs> the Her Courtesy went away and didn't come out for the rest of the night. The Her Courtesy is decent in PvE. Again, that damage is great, but it's less about getting one-shot kills in PvE and more about just putting as much damage as possible. You're also able to get a lot closer in PvE if you're using a shotgun, especially in something like the Prison of Elders and especially if you do have a Defender Titan bubble maybe. Uh, so range doesn't necessarily matter as much. Again, you much would prefer in PvE a shotgun that can shoot multiple rounds very quickly and get a massive damage per second rather than a massive damage per shot and that's where the her courtesy does excel so in summary it does seem like we have another pretty stale queen's weapon the her courtesy again just it doesn't suck and i don't want people to think it does and for how easy it is to get especially for casual players i mean this is a pretty pungent thing to add to your arsenal for pvp and PvE, but considering there's just better options, in PvP the Matter 64 is just plain superior, and in PvE something like the Found Verdict again is just better, for the experienced player like myself, for this person who has quite a lot in their arsenal, you're gonna want to look elsewhere for a good shotgun. But again, for the casual player, this gun really isn't bad, but it's just painfully average. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe if you did, and want to see more content similar to this. And as always, have a good day.